Hey everybody, Ricky Adam handicapping thoroughbred racing from the Big A at Quadrac Race Course, Ozone Park, New York, on Thursday, December the 12th. This is my day at the track.com and Equibase Naira, New York Racing Association race of the day. Let's take a look at race three this afternoon, folks, 1.18 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Fickle Fanny Stakes, six furlongs on Aqueduct's winterized inner dirt track. Phillies and mares, three years old, an up race for a stakes prize of $100,000. Contenders number one, Indian Splendor. Number five, Uno Duo. Number three, Lady Grace Note. And number four, Cara Me Away. This race honors, by the way, the career of the New York bred Fickle Fanny, a stakes winner who hit the board in 25 of 46 career starts, banking more than $382,000 for her owner, Richard Englander. This year's renewal of the Fickle Fanny number one Indian Splendor qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony. Is the overall speed leader in this field, sprinting at today's distance of six furlongs on the dirt. Has hit the board in four straight starts, winning twice, including a power run win in her second race back. Number five, Uno Duo, the morning line favorite, has hit the board in four of her last five, including power run wins in both her third and fifth races back. Jockey Junior Alvarado and trainer Bill Mott centered in the post for the Thursday feature. They fit the board with an even 50% of their entry saddled as a team to date. Race 3 summary, number 1, Indian Splendor. Tops the contenders list today here at the Big A, which also includes number 5, Uno Duo. Number 3, Lady Grace Note. And number 4, Cara Me Away. 1534 in the third from Aqueduct, the $100,000 Fickle Bay Stakes. Bonus long shots, Hawthorne, race six, number one, don't bluff, a 10 to one bomb, drops in class by five track master units, nice overall speed for this eight and a half for a long route test on the dirt. Charlestown, race seven, entry number six, just be romantic, six to one in the morning line, it's speed figure sprinting at tonight's specialized distance to seven furlongs on the dirt, which are comparable to the favorite, number four, Mellow Miss. So from Aqueduct on a Thursday, Rick Dean for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.